the Joe Rogan experience. But anyway, let's happen. let's take a look at this shit hoard. Mm. You ready? Am I ready? No one's ready. Never. I'm the only one I think who thinks this is hilarious. Okay. How will we blur this out? I'm not just gonna, I think I'm just going to not show it because it's known as like yeah. the, the worst don't, story don't on show, hoarders. You don't show it. it. Don't show it. <laughs> just show uh, Shane's face. Yeah. This lady's uh, show your stick. reactions. Shitting in bottles. <laughs> oh, boy. For a decade. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my Dude, God. That's here's her? Here's the best part. Is here's that the best her? Part. That's yeah. the lady? Yes. Oh, my God. There's shit everywhere. Dude. She. Oh my that's her God. shit bucket. <laughs> yeah. Dude, yeah, wow. wait. Watch, 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 watch. 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 This, this that's her shit start. bucket. And then she's like, sometimes it gets too heavy, so I have to transfer buckets. Christ, bro. I can't do this. <laughs> yeah. Hold on. She's I can't do this. Look at her, look at oh, her, my God, dude. Food. Shut the fuck up. She lives in a shit house. <laughs> <laughs> look at that. Full shit house. That's so insane. Look at that shit everywhere, dude. Oh, my God. I'm going to throw up. Ugh. Look at her shit bucket. I can't look. Bro, I can't look. look. You have to look. Look at her eating easy. soup, dude. Don't. <laughs> Jesus He's eating Christ. soup uh, on a pile of uh, shit. Dude. What the fuck, man? So this is the interview here. She goes, she goes. I can't be the worst hoarder you've ever seen. And look, they're like, look at this yeah, sign. It says, "I am okay." Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What this are you? Has something to do with smell. Yeah, this is the problem when you let kids think that I they're okay. I guess so because I thought it was due to the mold and dust. You have to tell me this because I, I. You don't have. Yeah. I mean, some people would argue. How do you not know that feces in the house is bad? But wait, I don't smell it anymore. It's an extremely dangerous house. <laughs> okay, okay, yeah. stop, 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 stop. <laughs> I will fucking throw dude, up. Dude, she's so matter of fact the <sighs> entire time. Like, the entire time, people are like, <sighs> she's like, yeah, there's mold in the walls. That's why it smells like that. And they're like, are you sure it's not the feces, bottles of feces and urine everywhere? And she's like, what? No, that can't be it. Like, no, that's definitely it. She's like, well, that's news to me. <laughs> like, Imagine if this was fake. And then they conned us. And that's like chocolate milk and... They didn't fake this. Paper. You can tell this lady's gone. Maybe she's like a really good actress. <laughs> mother used to put to poop put in a jug. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Dude. I so can't. at the very end, at the very end, this is the this is <laughs> this is the best part. So at okay. the very end, they're like, "We're gonna have to, uh, uh, we gotta go in there and clear out all the all the stuff in there." So all her food's contaminated. She doesn't her she doesn't have a refrigerator. She just has bread on the ground that's covered in mold. At one point they're like, "You can't eat that moldy bread." She's like, "I'm going to take the fucking mold off, obviously." <laughs> they're like, "All oh. right." At the very end they're like poop everywhere. Shit everywhere, dude. What do you think her like digestive tract is like? She's eating progressive soup dude. with shit in it. <laughs> She's eating nothing but soup. Because you you get a certain amount of shit <laughs> on your hands anyway. Into bottles, dude. Yeah. You know when they swab things, they find, like, human fecal matter on things all the time? Like, doorknobs and stuff. So, like, you're, if you eat a chip after you touch a doorknob, there's some fecal yeah, matter yeah. probably yeah. that gets in there. This lady's eating. All right, so at the very end, they're like, we got to go in there. And uh, she's like, hold on. Let me get one more night. I'm going to go ahead back in there and eat some contaminated food. And they're like, and then she goes, and then the party's over. They're like, you mean a party? What do you do? You think it's a party to eat contaminated food? She's like, what do you guys fucking care? I've been in there, I've been in there eating poop for 12 years. <laughs> They're like, what the fuck? Jesus. Hold on, when you get to that part at the very end, the dude, the dude, what, like, she says it, she goes, what do you care? I've been eating poop for 12 years. As soon as he says it, he goes, oh. <laughs> like, just watching a dude get defeated by a lady. I'm, try I'm trying to explain this properly. <laughs> the music, they play dramatic music. She goes, what do you guys fucking care? And he goes, he looks at her, she goes, I've been in there eating poop for 12 years. And he goes, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Just, she takes the guy's soul, dude. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, I'm trying to find it. It's right, it's towards the very end. They're giving her basically the intervention. It's what? two people outside. It's a lady imagine, and a guy. Imagine your yes, brain. Yes, yes, I'm going to go ahead back in there. <laughs> Watch. It's going to be hard, but I'm going to give up some stuff. This guy. And I, I'm going to go ahead and eat some of the contaminated food, and then the party's over. Because I have I to get it, that. because when somebody goes on intervention, they want to get high one last time. <laughs> the party ends for me tomorrow. How is eating contaminated food a party? I'm. Why the f does it matter? I've been eating poop for 12 years. <laughs> 
Dude. See, no one else thinks it's funny. Dude, dude. <laughs> no one dude. else. I'm thinks questioning dude. Alfred Baker. Not no one else thinks it's funny. So beyond dude. <laughs> reality. Dude. I don't think it's fake, but I've been fooled before. True. That's how it works. It seems like if you're, unless she's wearing prosthetics, it seems like a, there's. So, she. It seems like she's suffering the effects of her poor diet, like dude, the, the inflammation in her face from poop eating. At the end, <laughs> dude. At the end, they bulldoze the house and put her in an assisted living home. Oh it's not like god. a happy ending of hoarders. Oh my god! They said the house was beyond contaminated. The city had to get involved oh and destroy god. the land. They just salt the earth. That's so insane. It's pretty fun though. Just a lady and her mom shitting in a bucket. Before that, what was the worst one? The lady who eats toilet paper? Remember that lady? Uh, Did you ever see the lady who eats toilet paper? W that was uh, my sick addiction or whatever. Is that what it was? It's one of those. <laughs> I didn't. E I never even watched it. I watched this Hoarders episode. I never watched Hoarders. Yeah, she was just chewing up toilet paper, and she said it was addictive. No, there was a lady. The worst, the second worst Hoarders is a lady who had like 90 dead cats in her house. Oh, God. And she was saving them. Oh, my God. She was putting them in the fridge. She was like, oh, I, I don't want to say goodbye to these guys. Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> she takes oh them out. God. She takes them out for the camera. Their eyes are deteriorated. She's got a, <laughs> It's so fucking funny. Oh, oh no. Dude. Don't show me this. Yes. Come on, man. Collection. Oh, you guys got a oh, rat collection. Oh, rat collection, dude, rat collection. Watch this guy at the beginning. He goes, Oh, boy. Uh, he's like, Yeah, people try to talk about it, but until you tried it for yourself or something like that. What? Don't knock it until you try it. He has a million rats. What the fuck? <laughs> Whoa. Well, you know, there's like a temple <laughs> in India where rats are. Have you ever seen that rat temple in India? No. Oh, dude, this is wild. So, this is a temple in India. <laughs> And these rats all hang out with everyone. They eat with you. They they like leave the rats. They put milk out for them. Yeah. The rats are all drinking milk. They all they all like share. Yeah, it's the weirdest thing. It's like a temple filled with rats. So as these people are all praying, like dude, rats are everywhere, everywhere. So, but they're not treated poorly. Well, they got this wrong. But it's really weird, man. Because this is like. Look, the rats just like eat their food, and it's this beautiful temple. Let's see what this guy does. He guy have an explanation? No. Emily is here. <laughs> Let's see what he says. When they die, they're born as rats. When a rat dies, it's born as us humans. That might seem preposterous to many in the West. So they're just chilling. But people here. They think that they die and become a rat. Like yeah. A circle of life but they've managed to create an environment where they live with rats. Yeah. Well, there's going to be a new fucking plague if these guys keep doing this. Or not. They better knock it off. Seems dude. like it's working fine. Maybe that's how you avoid a plague. I bet these dudes get viciously ill constantly. <laughs> Imagine dude, the diarrhea they with, get. Yeah. Bro, Indian food and rat and you shit. Hang out with rats all day. <laughs> They're shitting all over the place. <laughs> yeah. That's the thing. It's like, oh, it's peaceful. No, it's rat shit. No, yeah. You, you, you 100% can't. get rat shit everywhere. But what if they're yeah. right, dude? What if you and me wake up rat? You're a mm. rat, dude. Thankfully, Why does... some guy's giving you milk.